A big thanks to all of my Patreon supporters. And a big thanks to all the donators of $5 or more. Dead Zirkling. Radio Raptor. And Vlad Tepish 3176. You all helped make this possible. Howdy, insufferable gaming fans. Your old pal Rosser here. Last time, I attempted to defeat the Nightmare Ganon fight and also to start the final dungeon. And I went from 66 deaths to 86 deaths in the course of like a video. But for all that, it turns out that the final dungeon wasn't where I was supposed to go yet. Oh no. We have to go back once more to the Tri-Floors. So, the Tri-Floors it is. As soon as I get, like, a safe place to stand... Well, that's not gonna do it. Anyway, the short version is I need to summon forth the tornado and take a ride to a faraway place. And then take a boat over to the Tri-Floors. Yes, I can get a red ring, but it's... Well, I was gonna say it won't be easy, but it will be easier than I was making it out to be. Don't do this to me, Tornado. I missed my ride, and now I have to go around again. That's unfortunate. But, I got a ticket to ride. Okay. So. Every time I enter the Tri-Floors anew, all those enemies come back. So, this might be a bit of a slog, but... Hopefully, I'll be able to manage it without too much dicking around. I'm just gonna go straight for the gusto. Because... I was given a map, and I know roughly where to go. Now, if only I wasn't gonna get my ass kicked by just really so very many enemies. Also, there may be a boss, I don't know. It's a bit of a mystery. Even one alive, so that I won't have to fight as many next time. Boing. So basically, I need to start by getting to the third floor um, entrance. Well, at least there will be fewer of them next time. I should probably be a little more careful in rooms like that, but I'm almost 100% certain that I'm going to have to do this a couple times. Take a drink. I'm very chill about going through this level again because... I've gotten used to it for one thing, and for another thing, I've got my Dr. Pepper with Jack, and also some Schmirnoff. You know, just whatever you can find, throw it in a cup. It doesn't have to be fancy, it gets the job done. What job is that? Why, the job of playing video games. with recklessly irresponsible volumes of booze. This too is how I roll. And if I keep this up long enough, I'm gonna be rolling down the stairs. The 
this next stretch will be a tricky one because I always, always get wrecked on this part until I clear out some of the monsters. There's at least two rooms full of whiz robes that are just the worst. I mean, this is one of the easier ones. This one, on the other hand, I may... You know what? What the hell? I can afford to use this medicine because it was free, and I can afford to use things that are free. If I run out, I'll go back and get some more for free. Alright. As long as I'm here, take out one more of those. And that room should be easy enough if I have to come back. I mean, it's nearly 100% positive that I will have to come back. It's just a matter of how many times. This room is devious just in, like, how many angles those guys can hit you from, case in point. So again, take out all but one, and that one I can stun. Oh yeah, this room. <laughs> it's pretty tricky, but um, I usually am able to get through this one, like, with net gain of lots of rupees, so I like this room. This room can come over, hang out, grill up some steaks. Yep, you just keep on scuttling there. It's like the game Centipede, but with better range of motion. Alright. Now I'm almost there. So from here, what I need to do, aside from not die, which is something I always need to try to do, is go this way, which I hadn't really done before. Um, let's see. And down from here... Ah. Wait, I can just do this. They can't do anything about it. Uh, that guy can, but he's a jerk. There. And now, if I go right from here, let me just um, get my bearings back. And there should be rooms with keys that I need to deal with. I need this. Hammer. For clear, obvious reasons. Okay. Um, and the bubble should count as leaving an enemy. So... Now, what have we here? Did you kill the second Guardian Gleok? Prove it to me. Alright, I am happy that there was a reason I got that meat. Hot dog. And there I am. There we are. It's the red ring. I could have had it before I tried to beat the Inferno Room and had it this whole time and just been having a much easier time but my dumbass doesn't know how to look at a map so thanks once again Atrus Wonder you have saved me a lot of frustration as long as I'm over here I suppose I might as well 
give that Ganon fight another shot. If I manage it first try with this red ring, I'm gonna feel like an idiot for not doing it sooner. Disaster? Okay. We good, we good. If I didn't have that red ring, I'd say I absolutely positively need to grind for hearts there. But I do have the red ring now. Also, I'll probably get some hearts in here. Anyway. A fairy or two, why not? I just gotta make it to the uh, full heal room. And then I can go from there. Really, my number one priority is just clearing these rooms out in case I have to make several attempts. Oh yeah, this room. I never did figure out the best way to deal with this room. But that wasn't it. All I can do is just tank it, basically. I mean, I could do it methodically, but that would take forever. Good enough. And another whiz robe room. The whiz robe rooms. Always a valid concern. Let's just get out of there real quick. How we doing? Alright, take this one out and... Don't bother with the other one. Because he'll just keep respawning. Oh yes, he will respawn. I don't like this room very much. Just because I always take way more hits than I feel like I should. I can't dodge in these tricky conditions. So, I've complained before about the D-pad on this Xbox controller. It's pretty lame, but uh, I've also found some games that are even worse with the Xbox controller D-pad. For instance, Super Metroid and Mortal Kombat. Oh no, 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 no! It was right the hell there. But yeah, Mortal Kombat was on sale on Steam for five bucks for the complete edition, so. Of course, I had to pick that up, being a longtime fan of the series. But, um... Trying to put in precise button combinations with this D-pad... I swear to Pete... Bit frustrating. What's not frustrating is the amount of progress I made in that last life, because... Despite having died... I made it a lot farther on one life than I did the last time I came through here. I think this is going to be a success, but I don't want to jinx it, so knock on wood. Those guys always get me. And I know better than to just run straight across, but I do it anyway. I'm just mentally challenged in that respect. Let's say... My greatest mental challenges include memorization, navigation, and calculus. 
I never could figure out that stuff. I tried. I tried real hard. I annoyed the hell out of my teacher, asking her constant questions, but uh, none of it ever really sank in. I mean, I can do, like, algebra and geometry. A very limited amount of trig. Frankly, I don't know how I even passed that class. I may not be smart enough to do advanced math in my head, but I am smart enough to know how to find a calculator. Because I can't imagine any situation where I'm going to be required to do advanced math and I also have no access to tools and equipment. I mean, I really am trying to think of a situation where that would occur, and I'm coming up with nothing. Like, if I'm stranded on a desert isle, I probably won't need to do super advanced math anyway. Like, maybe I could build a raft and navigate myself home using the stars, but I don't know anything about star navigation either. Astronomy. No astronomer am I. I look up there at the night sky, you know what I see? A whole mess of dots. Now, all that needs to happen is I need to get kinda lucky on the Ganon fight. It's a lot to ask for, but it's not completely impossible out of the question. It can be done. I might have to come back to this room a couple of times while I'm clearing out the path to the evil fairy. And I might need to take down at least one of these. Oh, that's a pain in the ass. Yep, this is the room I was worried about. We've dealt with these rooms before. That one, okay, went pretty quick. Except for I still made a mistake. Or two or twelve. And this room often trips me up. The best thing I've found is to just go ahead and kill all of the wall masters, because if I don't, I'm going for a ride. And that ride is going to be straight through solid matter. I hate it when I'm walking around minding my own business and a grubby blue hand picks me up and drags me through solid matter, kicking and screaming. Okay, if I can get through this room without taking too much damage, I'll just go ahead and start the Ganon fight. Well, I can honestly say I didn't get through it without taking too much damage, because I don't know why. Seems like there's always something, though. Yeah, I hate to do it, but I'm gonna... Go back. Refill on health. Yet again. Okay, grubby man hands aren't back yet. I'm feeling that vibe. Now, I've got mostly a clear shot. Woo hoo. Woo hoo. Woo hoo hoo. And woot. Especially Woot. Alright, this guy's gonna be obnoxious, clearly. Keep forgetting that I can stun that one particular armored foe. Every man hands. They decided that they knew better than to mess with me today. 
I'm gonna keep going in and out of here until those guys appear somewhere that's not directly in my route. Alright. Here we have it. Wish me luck. Now, get my medicine ready. Take a cup of rum to bolster me. Here we go. A fight. Eh, he got me. He's continuing to get me. Someone told me a really interesting strategy for this fight, which was to try to stay on the side and constantly take damage from the small fireballs because they hurt less. I've only hit him once this whole time. Okay, twice. He's over here somewhere. Um... Um... Keep, keep stabbing. Keep stabbing. Keep stabbing. Really, really keep stabbing. Yes, yes. Get that son of a bitch. No, 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 no. Ah. Uh, how many hits does that dick take? I feel like my dick's been taking a hit every time. Oh, take a drink. we go back. Come on. Don't be that floating eye monster. Be a kinder, gentler floating eye monster. Like the opposite of Fantoon. Frickin' Fantoon. hate Fantoon. Just one more reason why I don't like traversing the vacuum of space. Fantoon. It's an alien ghost that's an eyeball that shoots fire and it's got tentacles. I mean, come on. Like, John Carpenter would call that a bit excessive. Okay. Red Ring Attempt 2. The sequel. Yeah! See how much faster this goes when everything's cleared out. It's like the one advanced Zelda strat that I know of. So you would think that I would use it all the time without fail. I'm getting better at it though. Better at just like doing it out of hand. Bouncy, bouncy, bouncy. to equip my hammer. Um... I'd... These guys are a bit salty about something. Usually they're not that on the ball. Alright. I'm gonna take out some of these. There. There. 
there as we goes. Everything nice and easy. Nicey nice. Until we get to the Ganon fight. Then... It's just a red-ass beatdown in a room of fire. Did you see that bat? It was trying to bait me into killing it. It's very clever like that sometimes. I'm your huckleberry. That guy could conceivably cause me some problems. Ah! You see what they do? You see how they sneak up on you? They're clever. But I am far more clever still. <laughs> One of these days I'm gonna tell myself that and I'll believe it. Ah! That wasn't clever. Not by half. Okay. Do not shoot the evil fairy. I said to myself, calling me a dumbass. Alright. So, if I'm reading this properly... Which... I'm not... I don't think I'm doing this right. Um, yeah, okay. This works. I mean, it's kind of, if he ever shows up over here again, it's kind of a big if. I probably could have saved that. This is actually a decent strategy. I mean, it was until I started getting wrecked. But, yeah, I think if I get lucky, this could be an actual working way to beat this boss. Okay, fill up. That was just in time. Oh. Damn. It's taking a lot. Gonna get my bow ready. Uh oh. I'm 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 screwed. Stab faster. It's the only Nope, he got me. I don't know how many hits that was, but uh we're getting closer to getting him beaten. So, I may be able to find a gold ring in the next level as well, and then come back again with even more health. I think that might be the way to go, so I'll probably try that. But until then, thanks for watching. This is your old pal Rosser. Take a drink.